Toyota has unveiled the CHR Prologue concept, previewing the production version of the second generation CHR, which is slated to debut in 2023. The compact SUV has evolutionary styling and will be powered by hybrid and plug in hybrid powertrains. The outgoing CHR was introduced in 2016 and facelifted in 2019, making 2023 the perfect time for a new generation. The SUV proved quite popular among European buyers, so Toyota quickly decided to follow the same recipe as its successor in terms of exterior design and unconventional proportions. Thus, the CHR Prologue, like its predecessor, was penned by Toyota's ED2 studio in the south of France. The CHR Prologue is actually an evolution of the small SUV EV concept that went on sale in December 2021, along with several other prototypes. Minor changes to the bumpers, roof section and wheels bring it closer to production and confirm what we saw in recently leaked patent images. The hammerhead style nose with full LED headlamps is similar to other Toyota EVs and hybrids and suggests that this is the way forward for the Japanese automaker's design language. The front bumper has black elements surrounding the large intake which is covered for better aerodynamics. The profile is heavily sculpted with small windows reminiscent of the outgoing CHR. The triangular shape towards the front fenders is new with more emphasis on the rear quarter panels and C-pillars. Larger diameter wheels, a highly inclined rear window and shorter overhangs make the SUV look sportier and more compact than its predecessor. In addition, Toyota designers opted for a three-tone finish, combining metallic silver hues for the body with recycled carbon black for the rear and sulfur accents on the bumpers and rear spoiler. The production version is expected to retain much of the concept's exterior design, although some features, such as flush door handles and cameras replacing mirrors, may be changed to lower production costs. Toyota hasn't shown photos or renderings of the interior, but claims it's more spacious and practical than before. It can also be assumed that the new CHR will have more technology with larger screens for the digital cockpit, although the concept's tinted windows do not allow for a peek inside. While the company has confirmed that the new CHR will be available in hybrid and plug-in hybrid forms, it has remained tight-lipped on details about the platform and powertrains. This means it will be Toyota's third FEV offering in Europe, following the RAV4 and Prius. We suspect the SUV will be based on an evolution of the TNGAC architecture, which already underpins the slightly larger Corolla Cross and the new Prius. A plug-in hybrid setup can be had from the former and a FEV from the latter, though power outputs and range figures may differ on the smaller CHR. It is unclear whether Toyota will also produce an all-electric CHR like the Chinese-made model. Production of the new Toyota CHR will take place in Turkey, as with the current generation. The battery packs will be assembled in a yet unnamed facility in Europe using imported battery cells. We expect to learn more about the new CHR as we move closer to its market launch which is confirmed for 2023. The model will remain in the CSUV segment, slotting between the smaller Yaris Cross and the slightly larger Corolla Cross in Toyota's SUV range.